so I'm down to my last three sets of iterating between bench press and, and rowing. And uh, in the interest of time, because I have some clients coming soon, I'm going to superset in my planks. Now, regular plank, I'll just demonstrate it. Forearms on the ground and back straight, head up. Is my back pretty straight in? A little bit bent over. A lot more? Butt down. Yes. Yeah, there you go. So that's it, okay? That's a regular plank. Forearms are straight up and down. You're not like this. Okay, this is cheating. This is cheating. I want your forearms straight up and down. I have a pretty strong core. And if you do too, I'm going to invite you to progress your plank a little bit. I do them like this. So I'm going to stability ball. Okay? So. I'm going to try and do it for a minute. Do I get to time you now? No, I'm looking at the clock. Okay. You can just tell me when it comes to 10 after. Oh boy. So I gotta watch, make sure my forearms, sorry, my upper arms, are staying straight up and down. You're gonna to wanna to cheat by doing this. Okay, that takes the torque off the upper abdominals. I wanna do that. Time's it now? 10, ten two. Okay, 20 more seconds, folks. My abs are burning. I haven't done this in a long time. I used to do this for two or three minutes. Where is it burning, Mike? Is it burning right here? Quiet. <laughs> Time? Uh, ten after. Okay. That's hard because not only am I working rectus abdominis, but I also have to work my obliques and muscles that run kind of along my side from, side from my rib cage down to my pelvis. It's a muscle called QL, quadratus lumborum. Trunk stabilizers. Fancy term for all of them. And I gotta work them in order to not tip over. So that's today's workout. Squats, five sets, 10 to 14 reps. Bench press, bent row, five sets, 10 to 14 reps. And you can go right from one to the other because they're antagonist movements to each other. One's a push, one's a pull. They're not using the same muscles. And then abs. And you can superset the abs in. I'm only doing three sets. But you can superset them in with the push-pull because it's a different muscle group entirely. You're not using them on either of these exercises. Okay? See you next week. No, Friday. We got a new one for your Friday. Woohoo!